Public libraries. They are a common sight in American culture. Many people remember renting countless books from them throughout their lives. And today, residents can use them for computer access and even get digital books. But where do libraries get the money to keep up and maintain this public service? This millage is 90% of our operating budget, so it's critical. Libraries, like many other public services, rely on millages for funding. It, it funds staffing and all of our services. It funds our books and movies and music, magazines, um, hard copy and digital. For the Capital Area District Libraries, which has 13 branches, including in Okemos and Hazlitt, it is time to renew their millage, which is taxed annually and last collected in December of 2013. When 90% of your funding uh, comes from one source, that would be a huge reduction in the hours and the services we're able to provide to our public. So how does this tax affect you? Let's say the market value of your house is $100,000. That would mean the taxable value of your house is $50,000. With the proposed millage, you'd owe $78 a year, or 21 cents a day. I really hope that people will support this millage. It's very important to our community to have a good, strong library system. The millage is a renewal of the previous rate, and if passed, will be in place for the next four years. If denied, the Capital Area District Library Governing Board would have to find ways to make up these funds. We received no comment from those opposed to the proposal. In Meridian Township, Dan Ray, Home TV.